Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to talk about the uncirculated and proof silver dollars from the 2024 Greatest Generation commemorative set that I received today from the United States Mint. If you enjoy the content, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons. I really appreciate it. Now let's get started. The coins in this program commemorate the National World War II Memorial and the Service and Sacrifice of American Soldiers and Civilians during World War II. Both dollars are 99.9% .9 silver with a weight of 0.859 troy ounces and were minted at the United States Mint in Philadelphia. The United States Mint release of these silver dollars included a surcharge of $10 to benefit the non-profit friends of the National World War II Memorial, to support the National Park Service in maintaining and repairing the National World War II Memorial and for educational and commemorative programs. The World War II Memorial in Washington, D.C. is a poignant monument that honors the 16 million Americans who served in the armed forces during World War II including the more than 400,000 who died. Situated on the National Mall between the Lincoln Memorial and the Washington Monument, it was dedicated on May 29, 2004. The memorial's design encompasses a plaza and a fountain encircled by 56 granite pillars representing U.S. states, territories, and the District of Columbia at the time of the war, interconnected by bronze ropes symbolizing national unity. Two triumphal arches, representing the Atlantic and Pacific theaters of the war, anchor the north and south ends. Here we have the uncirculated silver dollar. The packaging includes documentation about the Greatest Generation commemorative coin program and descriptions of the devices and details on both the dollars, obverse and reverse. I'm really happy to see the clamshell packaging has returned for this release. It might be a little thing, but the packaging that the Mint has been using for the last few years felt cheap and unsubstantial. This is the uncirculated dollar. The obverse design features six figures working together to support the Earth, illustrating the cooperation of each of the military, Army Air Force, Coast Guard, Navy, Army, and Marine Corps, as well as the Merchant Marine during World War II. The level of detail on this coin is fantastic. The reverse design features a view from beneath a Baldacchino sculptural canopy inside a Victory Pavilion in the World War II Memorial in Washington, D.C. The sculpture depicts four eagles holding a laurel wreath, within which is a globe centered on the Pacific Ocean. Next, we have the proof dollar. The coin is inscribed with 1941 to 1945, World War II War Memorial, Defenders of Freedom, Liberty, In God We Trust, and 2024. The inscriptions on the reverse are United States of America, A Pluribus Unum, Victory, In the Air, At Sea, on land, WW2 Memorial, and $1. One of the first thoughts I'm having is that while the uncirculated dollar is nice, I'm not sure it is as nice as the silver proof. Proof finishes are often a favorite of collectors, and for good reason. When you have a coin with the level of detail that these dollars do, I think the proof finish amplifies more of the subtle detail. Devices, words, and little nuances tend to pop more than on an uncirculated example. And there we have it. The uncirculated and proof greatest generation silver dollars. At first go, I am a fan of these coins. What do you think? Let me know in the comments. Thanks for your time. Cheers.